When one door closes, another one opens. Well, this is, at least for my mom. Hi <laughs> to mama. Let's say bye to your grandma. You wear the same shirt as Esteban? America shirt. These guys are America friends like daddy. America. Esteban's gonna cry. What song were you singing? It's been a long time. What, what is that? It's like without you, my friend. It's from Fast and Furious. Esteban's sad. You're it's okay. You're moving on to better things. Looks like Stefan is gonna drive. You gonna drive? <laughs> I wanna show Jordy something. Is it Apple? You know from TikTok? Oh yeah. It's actually real. I say do it. Hold on, I'm gonna drink a little bit. You have to drink a little bit first? Yeah, so later. We go out a bit. Can't do huh? Yeah. <laughs> you see? Can we go so dirty? Who's sizing? Huh? Who's sizing? It's, it's your grandma's new car. <laughs> you like it? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. This is her, their moving truck. It's called the U-Haul. But no kids allowed. Let's go. Let's drive. Let's go. Esteban doesn't know how to drive. Tell him no. No. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. How do you feel about your grandma moving? Are you sad? Or are you happy? I have both of them. You have both of them? Yeah. Where are you going? Come here. What? Are you gonna miss her? Mm-hmm. Yeah? You're not gonna come you're not gonna be able to come spend the night here anymore. Or come over. Grandma's not gonna come bring you snacks like she used to. You're just avoiding it, huh? Bye. And they're off. All the neighbors are out here saying bye. It's so sad. Oh, I'm really crying. This fall. I cannot believe I cried. I'm just so sad. But then again, I'm happy. Why are you being shy, baby? Hey, be nice. The car is packed because we took some things that mom was going to get rid of. It's like, I'm so sad, you know, she's leaving, but then again, I'm happy for her. Uh, Very sad. Cut off. Cut off. I'm not sad. You're sad? Yeah. Why are you sad? I sad. I really love that house. You really love that house? Yeah, you too Yeah, I love it too. But like I was saying, it's just so emotional because, you know, we have so many memories there. Oh, mom and kids. And, excuse me, I just, it kind of breaks my heart talking about it. Because it's, I just, Jordy's just looking at me because I'm kind of crying. I'm just sad because, you know, my mom's not going to be, like, down the street anymore. And I'm not the one to record myself crying, but I'm just really sad because that's my fault. And she's always lived far Don't from us. And then it was, it. it was so nice to have her living close to all of us. Um, you know, it was nice to her to always come visit us. And she was always there for the kids. But don't get me wrong, I'm happy for her. I'm very happy that she's doing this move. And I'm also very happy that it's not far away. You know, we can just go visit her anytime. But I'm extremely happy for her because, you know, she got a better opportunity for her. I'm a hot mess. But I know I'm always going to watch this. If you're watching this, Mom, we love you. We're happy for you. And we're proud of you. And we're going to miss your cooking. But... I'm gonna stop recording myself. Not sure. This is not so okay. Much. You love your grandma so much. Yeah. Do you want to give your grandma a message? Um, no. No. What about you, Jordy? Mm -hmm. No, I don't know. Tell her that um, you gonna miss her cheesecake or <laughs> her mole. Her mole. Really good. Yeah. 
What? You tried that one. You tried that one? <laughs> no, 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 that's just a little white bird and a black bird. That's cool. Oh my god, this is the song that Stan was talking about. Yeah, I know. What a coincidence. He was, oh, don't mind the dusty car. But this is the song that he was singing right before. Yeah, it's the song that my Alice is coming on. I was crying. But don't mind me. I got the mask on because we're doing curbside pickup for Best Buy. Well, it's, a, it's okay. You don't have to have a mask on. They're just going to ask mommy to have a mask on. Here you go. You can hear it. <laughs> this song's for you, Stevan. Woo! <laughs> this is the song that he was singing. Like I said, he's so cute. That's my. Ooh, hit the vocals, dirty. That's um. What am I? I'm, I always forget how many siblings I have. I think it's six of us, two girls, one of my four brothers. So I'm, I'll give you guys a little backstory. I'm the oldest of six. Woohoo, yeah, me, I'm the oldest. It's just, so I'm the oldest, then my brother, Jose, then my sister, Paola, then Callie, and then it's Esteban, which is. And don't forget about Bola. Yes. And Sanga. And, and yeah, then Sanga. Sanga's the baby. Mm -hmm. Adon, that's a grandchild. <laughs> but who is Bola? Uh, that's your brother. And who is he to you? My uncle. Your uncle? Do you remember when you went to go visit him? Yeah. Yeah. Arizona. Okay, so this is so silly. We have a picture. We do have a picture of him. <laughs> and all of us taking a picture. Oh, great. Here comes the dude with our stuff. Hi. What's up, G fam? So, the little clips you guys just saw were, you know, very emotional. And, um, just wanted to talk over a little bit. So, um, how did I go about this? I was saying, I originally wanted to vlog today, but then I was like, if you brought it, I'm like, eh. Let me just enjoy the moment, live in the moment. But then I was like, let me just film the moment, look back at the memories, yada yada. Ended up vlogging a few little clips. And, um, you know, just for memories. But I do, you know, it is a very sad day. We, I mean, I know I'm sad. The kids, I know they're a little too young to even say or think anything but on another note I know it's not my topic to speak on it's my I know it's my mom's personal life and um, I don't want to get too much into detail but you know she is moving away from us so and that is very sad and touching to us because you know we love her dearly um, and I just wanted to catch that on video um, because, you know, it is very sad. I'm sad. My heart is broken. <laughs> like, I'm just so sad because, like, I was driving there. Don't mind the back. I'm doing laundry. But, yeah, I was driving to my mom's, and then I was like, oh, my God, this is six. I was just so devastated. I was like, this is, like, the last time I'm going to drive here. Like, the last time. And it's just so hard to think about it. Um, you know, because... It's your mom who doesn't want their mom with them at all times I know you're an adult you got to grow up and live your life eventually but um, it's just very tough on me but I feel like I'm just rambling but my point is that like I was just so happy to have my mom close enough because the boys love her they have a great relationship with her um, I love their their bond their relationship and it's you know heartbreaking because it's they're not gonna have that on the daily like they used to but like I said before I am happy that we do get to visit her my makeup is crazy right now my eyelashes falling off because I've been crying like a baby all day okay so without 
sharing too much information and exposing my mom's personal life, although I kind of did because, um, you know, telling the whole world she's moving, but I'm not telling you guys where she's moving. <laughs> but I just wanted, you know, to have that on video to look back at one day and look back and, you know, see that we blossomed and we grew. But, you know, it is very sad, devastating. Like I said, I'm heartbroken. It's my mom who doesn't want to live with um, near their mom, you know, because it's, it's your mom. Hello, your parents. You know, my father is not, um, our father's in the picture, but he's not, he, does, he lives very, very far away, and that's a different topic, story. And my mom's like the closest thing we have. So now that she's moving, moving away, it's hard, especially since the bond kids have with her. Their bond is just so amazing. Like she would always literally, each time she would go to Costco, she'd come by, drop things off for the kids. They just loved her. Like their eyes lit up as soon as they saw her. And, um, you know, it's going to be sad not having that here locally, but I'm thankful and grateful that she has a better opportunity and that um, we still get to visit her. She's not going to be extremely, extremely far away, but, you know, I'm still such a big crybaby because who doesn't want all crap? Karma sign. <sighs> but, yeah, so comment down below how you guys cope with all this because I know for a fact, me, I'm just a big emotional wreck for everything. I'm a big crybaby. But, I know I can cope with this, I'll get through it, and I'm gonna be crying for a couple days, but I'll be okay, I'm gonna go visit my mom when I can. And um, I wish my mom well, I know she's gonna see this. So we wish my mom nothing but great success in her new place. We'll be tearing it up when we go visit her. Just kidding. <laughs> but mom, like I said, we love you. Keep striving, and we are proud of you, and we'll see you soon. Um, of course, we're gonna miss you, but thank God for FaceTime because we'll be FaceTiming a lot, like we already did anyway. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. You know, it was kind of crazy all over the place, but just wanted to share this moment with you guys. If you have not subscribed, make sure you subscribe, turn on your post notifications so you can get notified each time we post a new video. And if you haven't, make sure you get to, if you haven't done so already, like this video and comment down below and share it and we'll catch you guys in our next video thank you guys so much peace be blessed